An East Idaho family continues to grieve the loss of a husband, father, and brother after Jeffrey Jagger was killed in a construction accident at Longfellow Elementary School in Idaho Falls. A construction project in this KPVI News 6 investigative report, our Logan McDougall takes a look at the safety record of the two companies tied to his death, Bateman Hall and Wheeler Electric. According to the latest numbers from the Occupational Safety and Health Administration, just over 360 workers have been killed on the job in fiscal 2014, and sadly an East Idahoan's name is now added to that list. Bateman Hall Incorporated, the main contractor for the school, has employed the services of Wheeler Electric Incorporated to perform some of the work on the school. So what are the two companies' safety records for safety on the job site? OSHA classifies safety violations into several categories, serious, willful, repeat, and other than serious. Serious violations indicate a substantial probability to cause death or serious physical harm. Willful happen when an employer knowingly commits a violation. Repeats occur when a company is cited again for the same violation, and other than serious happen when a violation has a direct relationship to job safety but would probably not cause death or serious harm. Since 2004, Bateman Hall has been fined a little over $6,000 for violations on its job sites, the most being in October of 2004 at a job in Buell for $2,400, when the agency cited them with a serious violation under fall protection standards. The company has also been cited under general requirement, wiring methods, components, and equipment standards. That same time period has seen Wheeler Electric pay a total of $2,100 in fines to OSHA. In 2009, the company was fined $1,400 for two other than serious violations under general requirements. In 2008, the company was fined $700 for failing to comply with wiring methods, components, and equipment standards. Jose Carnavali with the U.S. Department of Labor says OSHA is currently investigating Jagger's death. Todd? Back to you. Okay, Logan, thank you. According to a company spokesman quoted by the Associated Press, Jagger had worked for Wheeler Electric for 13 years. For more information on the two company safety records, you can find a link in the story at kpvi.com.